Now, Henry Serretta didn't make it past his first birthday. In fact, he only made it seven months. Intense chemo helped him beat cancer, but it couldn't repair the damage done to the young boy's body. And before he was born, his parents said that he would change the world. And while his time with the living was short, somehow he did just that. Henry was just happy. This kid was going to change the world in some fashion. That was what we told everybody. A tall task, change the world. When Tim and Aaron welcomed their baby boy into the world, they knew he was different. He just brought that happiness out in others. Whether it was mom and dad or a relative, if he was being held, his smile was beaming. And we like to talk about him. What's a bit harder to talk about is how he fell ill. He just wasn't himself. You know it's bad when they take you right past the way station. Her face was said it all. Tim and Aaron knew their boy was sick. Their worst thought? maybe pneumonia. And so to hear leukemia was kind of like a punch to the stomach. I remember putting my hands on my face, doubled over and cried. And my brain just completely shut off. Henry had acute myeloid leukemia, but Henry fought and fought and fought. 12 days in, mom and dad knew it was taking a turn for the worst. They could barely sleep. At 3 a.m. on the door it was, we opened the door, one of the nurses that had transported him by ambulance said, you know, he's not going to make it. He was a fighter. In fact, the cancer was gone, but the damage it had done, the chemo, everything, it was too much. Mom held him as his final breaths left this little fighter's body. There couldn't have been a better way for that to happen because he got to go out being loved so much. That's hardly the end of Henry's story. Remember his dad's promise he would change the world? He is. In 2015, they held a blood drive. Turns out blood transfusions gave them those final 12 days with Henry. Without it, they never could have said goodbye. Now there's plans for another blood drive. In fact, they plan to have them again and again. His story already beginning to spread. And we were walking and we heard, hey, Henry's mom and dad. And we, yes, they're even recognized as Henry's parents. It's like, that was the coolest way I think I've ever been addressed in my life. In our world, he's everything and he's amazing and we just want to carry that on. Allowing Henry to change the world just like mom and dad knew he would. Changing the world in a new way they never saw. Now, Henry's parents will be honored at this year's Heartland Awards Luncheon. A thanks for all the work they're doing to get people out to donate blood. The event will be held at the Embassy Suites La Vista Conference Center.